Let's solve these problems. Add the following integers. So let's start with 1, 2, plus 5. So how do we add integers? So for our first problem, notice that we have like signs. So we have positive 2 and positive 5. So if we have like signs, we just add the absolute value of the numbers. So we add 2 plus 5. Disregarding the signs, so that will be 7. And then we just need to copy the same sign, which is positive. So we have positive 7 or simply 7. For number 2, we have negative 3 plus negative 7. So this time, we are adding also like signs, but they are both negative. So if that's the case, we simply add the absolute value of the numbers, again disregarding the sign. So, 3 plus 7, that will be 10. And then, copy the same sign on the final answer, which is negative. So, we have negative 10 as the final answer. For number 3, we have negative 8 plus 11. So, this time, we are adding unlike signs. So, 1 negative and 1 positive. So, if that's the case, we subtract the smaller absolute value, which is 8, from the bigger absolute value, which is 11, so we disregard the signs, and then we will have 11 minus 8 or 3. But on the final answer, we must put the same sign of the number that has the bigger absolute value. In this case, the positive 11, right? So the final answer should be positive 3 or simply 3. For number 4, we have 19 plus negative 6. Okay, so this time, we are adding again unlike signs. So we have one positive and one negative. So doing the same in number 3, we subtract the smaller absolute value, which is 6, from the bigger absolute value, which is 19, disregarding the signs again. So 19 minus 6, that will be 13. And we follow the sign of the bigger absolute value in the final answer, that is positive 19, right? So therefore, the final answer should be positive 13 or simply 13. Next, for number 5, we have negative 1 plus negative 4 plus 10 plus 4 plus negative 12. Okay, so let's start with the first two numbers, negative 1 plus negative 4. So they have like signs, they are both negative, so, we add the absolute value of the number. So, 1 plus 4, that will be 5. But, we must follow their same sign which is negative. So, we have negative 5. Next, we need to add 10. So, this time, we are adding unlike signs. So, 1 negative and 1 positive. So, if that's the case, we subtract the smaller absolute value which is 5 from the bigger which is 10. So, we will have 10 minus 5 or 5, but we must follow the sign of the number with the bigger absolute value, which is this positive 10. So, this should be positive 5 or simply 5. And then, next is we need to add 4. So, this time, we are adding like signs again. They are both positive, right? So, 5 plus 4, that will be 9. And then, copy the same sign on the final answer, which is positive. So, you have positive 9 or simply 9. And then finally, we need to add 9 plus negative 12. So this time, we are adding unlike signs. So 1 positive and 1 negative. So again, let's subtract the smaller absolute value, which is 9, from the bigger, which is 12. So 12 minus 9, that will be 3. And then we copy the sign of the 1 with the bigger absolute value which is the negative 12. So the final answer should be negative 3. Okay, so now it's your turn. So try to solve these problems and just comment your answers.